Hello everyone. This is Naomi Consults. Welcome back to my channel. I'm just here to do a very quick video because due to popular demand, I remember I did a video on um, on a bono soup and how I blended my bono with wet blender. And uh, some persons were, you know, calling asking how did I blend it? I should do it again because it wasn't very, you know, uh, explicit. So I'm just here to do a very little obono, to blend very little obono, just to show us how I blend my obono in a wet blender or in a smoothie maker, whichever one you want to use. So for today, I'm not using my full big blender because the obono is very small. I'm using this smoothie maker to, one of my smoothie maker. And the first thing to do is to get your oil. The oil is your base. It's like the water you are going to use to blend, actually. So you don't. There's no water in this blending. Don't add water. So all you need is your red oil. You just put a little red oil as your base. I have a little. Um, okay, that's just enough because. Your bono blending is really little. Look at it. So then, when you do this after the the after the uh, whatever the oil, then you put this is your bono. I'm assuming that I'm using a blender, but this is a smoothie uh, maker. So when I turn it, it's going to turn all the other way. I know, but then after the bono, you add your crayfish you add your crayfish at this point if you have if you want to blend your pepper if you are using fresh pepper like a, a scotch bonnet pepper alongside this is where you add it you add it on top of your crayfish but since i'm using um i'm using a smoothie maker so i'm going to put add a little oil on top of this crayfish because I'm using smoothie blender, so this is it. So if you are using your blender, this is what you do. The obono is your the red oil is your base. Obono goes out right after. Then the next thing is your crayfish. Then if you are using pepper, you just add your pepper to it. So that's all you need to do. Then you just close. But because it's a uh, smoothie maker, just let just do this so the oil can incorporate it. If the oil is not enough, I'm going to add a little more oil. But let me just see if this will blend it. Okay, so. So, it's obvious that my oil is not enough for this blending because I'm using a smoothie maker and I need enough oil to go around. So, I'm going to add oil. It's just like when you are blending and the, the water is, you need water to blend. If the thing is too dry, whatever you are blending, all you need is just add water. It's exactly the same thing I'm doing. So, the oil is like the liquid the liquid I'm using to bring my my seed to be smooth uh -oh, my hand is slippery okay I got it making a bono today so this is just to show us so what i'm doing right now is i'm blending the bono so because the bono is really small it will take a little while but if it's just a normal the way i did it the last time the normal blender i'm using and i'm making a bono like a cup of a bono this one is not even up to half cup of bono i'm using i just want to use it to show to us how i blended my bono for those of us that didn't get it the last the, the first time so this i 
I just want us to see the inside of my blender. You see that? So, if it's just full blender, this you see. If it's not smooth to your taste, you go back and blend it. But this is it. This is what you get. It's very smooth. So that's it. This video is very quick. I just really wanted to show us how I blend my bono. You don't need to go about looking for blended, already blended bono, especially for those of us that live in, in live outside the Nigeria. For those in Nigeria, they can easily blend their bono dry. But if you don't have the, the dry, the coffee blender or the dry blender, you don't, it's very easy. You just do this. Or just dedicate your if you have blender have more than three or four blenders in this house but if even if you have only one the same blender you use to blend your tomato you can actually dry it up and use it to blend it the wet one not the the wet blender not uh, if you may not use your smoothie maker because i have more than two smoothie maker that's why i can dedicate this for for oil or whatever i'm, I'm using it to do so guys please if you enjoy this video, if you like it, give me a thumbs up, share my video, subscribe if you have not subscribed. If you have subscribed to my channel, please thank you and please keep sharing my video. Thank you so much for, for your subscription and keep sharing this video. Share to your friends and family, let them know what we are doing. God bless you and see you very soon. Bye-bye.